everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to be doing a try on haul and review of accessories and clothing from rose gal this video actually has a little bit of a theme i know we're a little bit early because it's not even october yet but this is a halloween themed video so everything that i'm going to be showing you in this video is going to be halloween themed so if you haven't shopped with Rose Gal before, they're a clothing website that goes up to size 8 to 32. So I've got earrings, dresses, a few tops from Rose Gal to show you guys today. Just a little disclaimer, Rose Gal have gifted me all of these items, just a little disclosure for you all. So thank you so much to Rose Gal for sending me all of these items. So without further ado, let's have a look and see what I got from Rose Gal. So as usual we're going to be starting off with the accessories first and then I'll show you guys all of the clothes that I got. So the first pair of earrings that I got were these cat earrings and honestly they are bigger than I thought they would be but look at the cute picture of the cat. I was, Obviously I was drawn to these because I love cats, they're my favourite animal. And yeah they just look so cute, let's try them on and see what they look like. They just have simple fish hook backs on them. Oh, they're so cute. I thought they would be a little bit long on me because of how huge they are, but actually they sit quite nice. The quality of them feels nice. They've actually got like a leather material, which is actually quite different to what I expected. But the picture is such good quality and they're absolutely perfect for Halloween if you're a cat lover like myself. I might actually wear these for the rest of the video after I've shown you guys the other two pairs of earrings that I got, so I'll take them out for now. So the next pair of earrings that I got are another teardrop style pair of earrings, a bit like the cat ones, except these are like resin, I think. They're definitely made out of resin and they have a crime scene design on them, which is very Halloween-y. Let's try them on and see what they look like. They're a very similar shape to the cat ones, but they're slightly smaller, but they're very cute and they're definitely very Halloween themed. I think these would be perfect just to spice up a Halloween makeup look or something. That's definitely what I'll be using these for. But yeah, these are so cute. I love them. I think I'll be wearing them in some of my creative makeup looks. And the last pair of earrings, I did only get three pairs of earrings. And this is the last accessory as well until we move on to the clothes. I got these spiderweb earrings. They sort of reminded me of Spider-Man, so I had to get them because Spider-Man. Also, they just will be perfect for some Halloween looks. One side has three webs on them and one side has only two webs on them. So it's actually a little bit different. They're not like symmetrical earrings, which is quite cool. And let's just see how they look. I have a feeling that the three web one is going to look very long and be draping on my shoulder. Yes, it is a little bit. I thought that this one would drape on my shoulder a little bit too much, but they still look very cute. I love that they make their earrings like huge, but I absolutely love extreme dangly earrings, like ones that are really long. Although considering I have a small neck, it's probably not a very good look on me since they just sort of drape down here like this one is right now. But they still look very cute. I honestly think they're going to be really good to complement some of these Halloween outfits that I'm about to show you. And also for my creative makeup looks on my TikTok, on my Instagram, on Facebook. And yeah, on the run up to Halloween, have a look on my social media channels. You'll probably be seeing some of these earrings and some of my creative makeup looks and some of my plus size fashion videos. Anyways, that is all of the accessories. Let's move on to the clothing. So this is the first dress that I got from Rose Gal. Some of these are advertised as t-shirts and some of them are advertised as dresses. So this one was advertised as a dress, but the other ones, I think they're advertised as t-shirts. They look like they're going to look like dresses on me because I'm quite short. Um, but anyways, just to be safe, I've kept my leggings on underneath. Anyways, this is a Halloween bat dress underneath. There is an orange layer and then over the top there's this mesh with a bat pattern on it and honestly it looks so gorgeous I just had to tighten the straps up a little bit um, because they were like hanging down here it's definitely longer than I expected it to be but with Halloween dresses you kind of expect them to be longer because they're sort of like a witch sort of vibe if you get what I mean but yeah this is so cute and honestly it's got such a nice quality to it as well like it feels good quality so I'm really, really impressed with the material of it. I've got a bar on underneath it, so this is not actually part of the dress, even though it looks like it is. This is the dress. It sort of has the cup shapes on it, but as we all know, I sort of don't agree with these sort of things. Like, it'll literally look like I'm hanging out of it, so I don't, I don't really like that sort of look. But you could put like a corset underneath this, or maybe over the top, just to cinch in your waist a little bit, or cinch in this bit under the bust, because it gives you a little bit more of a flattering shape. But even without, I'm absolutely in love with this. I think I'll be wearing this on the 31st, honestly. I'm not going out trick or treating or dressing up or anything. I just think it'll give me some Halloween vibes. I don't know if you can tell, it does reach just above my feet. It is just. Because 
because I'm short so if you're a bit taller it might come up a little bit higher on you like it sort of feels velvety at the top like the bats sort of feel like velvety yeah I think they are it's sort of got like a velvety fabric on the bats which just goes with what I just said about the quality of this item it's honestly unmatched I'm so so impressed with it and I could literally just wear it with this bra and everybody will think it's like part of the dress but it's not very noticeable at all um so hey guys this is me editing right now and I don't think I realised how shiny my bra looked like on camera when I was filming it, but I definitely do see it now and it is definitely very noticeable. Um, so just ignore that I said that and I'll try and sort it out for when I do my outfit idea videos for like TikToks. Uh, so keep an eye on how I style it for them videos, uh, but just literally just ignore that I just said that. Yeah, I really like this. This is really pretty. Let's just have one last look at it before we move on to the next item. Yeah. I just wanted to say to you guys how worried I was about the next few items, about the sizing. I don't think the measurements on Rose Gal are very accurate because it doesn't tell you how much it stretches up to. The only thing that I was guaranteeing on when I bought all of these and hoping that they would fit was the description of the items saying that it was high stretch and they were not joking. These are high stretch items so I'm very very pleased about that. I got all of these in a 4XL and I was so worried that they weren't going to fit but they're very very stretchy which is amazing if you're plus size. I don't think the measurements are that accurate which is not usually the case when I'm clothes shopping but if you look at the description and it says high stretch they are not lying it is high stretch also like I said I think this it might work as a dress for me it is very long on me but it does come right up to here on me on the sides which is a little bit scary so I think I'd still wear leggings with this it's got a skull pattern on the bell sleeve here like over the top of this red bit and it's sort of giving me Dracula it is it's giving me Dracula sort of vibes I love that I can buy something that looks a little bit like a corset that actually will fit me and won't look really tight on me the quality of it is very like stretchy yeah it's sort of got like a swimming costume sort of material to it but you wouldn't think that when you look at it just because of all the layers it's got it looks really complimentary let's have a look at it in the full this is what it looks like I'm absolutely in love with these belts sleeves by the way they look amazing and the cut as well down here it sort of cuts down to these points it sort of gives very gothic sort of vibes but you would normally have to put layers on to get a look like this but this is like a look in one if you know what I mean like this is like a look that you would put together but it's all in one uh, there's a lot of room in the boob area as well which is amazing for me before I made this video I watched a few other rose gal like hauls and a lot of people with smaller boobs were saying that these are too big and I thought that's going to be perfect for me because my boobs are too big the other two that I'm about to show you have the same sort of vibe but they're just purple um and like I said they are advertised as tops these do sort of look like dresses on me so I could probably just wear these as a dress but it is very high cut at the side so I'll probably wear like tights underneath or leggings okay next one so this one is very similar style to the other one like I said they were going to be got the bell sleeves again there's no lace on this one I think it's sort of more of a corset vibe like the corset is actually up here on the bust this time I absolutely love this color scheme by the way I love purple and black together I love purple it's my absolute favorite color but also I didn't notice this before but it's sort of got like a belt here that sort of cinches in here and then it gives you the bell sleeves so yeah this looks so amazing <laughs> very spooky again and also the stretch is unmatched you could literally i could probably have went down a size and i was so worried that it wasn't gonna fit me i needn't have worried at all this has so much stretch in it they don't lie when they <laughs> say high stretch on the website also this one has a ri the ribbon tied up so maybe i should do that with the other one you know the one that just dangled down i think i should tie it up a bit like this one but yes let's step back i've still got my leggings on by the way but i've got a perfect pair of tights to wear with these oh they match my socks but i do have a perfect pair of tights to wear with this it's the same sort of color I'm trying to think of what it's giving me it's sort of giving me ursula giving me ursula sort of vibes maybe i could do an ursula cosplay with this it's sort of a swimsuit sort of material again it's also that outfit and one sort of feel again where usually you'd have to layer like several different things over the top but they've done that but just like with one piece of clothing and it's just perfect for plus size people honestly like i'm always so scared that stuff won't have stretch in it but all of these have stretch in it and i feel so comfortable as well like it doesn't feel like it's digging in on me or anything it doesn't feel uncomfortable i do i feel so comfortable in this if you're one for your comfort as well like some of the outfits i wear on like my tiktok and stuff like i probably wouldn't wear that out like with the belt and everything because it's just really uncomfortable for me this is the sort of thing that i probably would wear out and about if 
I wasn't like trying to impress anyone, but I'd still impress them, you know, because it looks fire, you know? The next one that I'm about to show you has the same sort of colour scheme to this, but it's a bit different. To think that I was so worried about these <laughs> pieces, but they like fit me perfectly, and the stretch is like amazing on these. Yeah, well done, Rose Gal. Let's look at the other one. Okay, so let's just say I am very glad that I put leggings on for this one. This is actually a little bit different to the other two that I just showed you. It actually clings to me a little bit more. It's not flowy at the bottom. It's sort of like got a bodycon sort of vibe. And it's definitely more of a top than the others. Um, because it stops like right here. And I would definitely be too scared to wear this with tights. This is definitely a top that needs to go with like leggings. I actually have a black skate skirt that I could put over the top of this. That would look really cool. Still got the really cool bell sleeves. These are the biggest bell sleeves we've seen yet. Look at these. We've got the skulls again on my arms. I'm a very big fan of these bell sleeves i love these i feel like a witch also i feel like this is about to burst honestly this is like stretching a little bit it's that outfit in one sort of feel again so this actually has its own strap like if it was built into the lace a little bit more i think it would sit a little bit better but it's actually on its own here like look like it's that's probably why it's not sitting right on me to be honest you probably wouldn't even notice that if you were looking at me it's just me who notices it i don't know what the hell is going on here look it's just a gather of ribbons. I don't think I'm a fan of this. I might have to sort it out at one point. This sort of looks like a lace jacket sort of vibe. I love the frills. It goes right up here. Yeah, it does look very flattering. I do love it. It looks nice with leggings, but I wish it flowed out a little bit more. I really do. I love that flowed out sort of look that the other two have, and this one doesn't, and I love the sleeves of this one. If I could have the flowed out look at the bottom on this one as well, this would have been my favourite. I wasn't expecting it to be clingy to me. It still has a lot of stretch, but because the lace is over the top, it sort of brings it in a little bit more. So compared to the other two, this is a little bit less stretchy. And like I said, I'm in love with these bell sleeves. This makes this one a win for me because I love this. This is just one that I'd have to wear with black leggings or maybe I could invest in purple leggings so it sort of like matches the little purple top underneath. But the other two like t-shirts that I just showed you, you could probably wear them as dresses, wear them with tights. This one, I think you need something a little bit thicker on the bottom because look at this. That is not going to cover my bum unfortunately. The sleeves. The sleeves is my favourite part about this one. I love flapping them around. I'm like Sophia Nygaard, she loves her bell sleeves as well. If you watch Sophia, you'll know exactly what I mean. <laughs> Anyways, this was the last piece of clothing. Let's go to the outro. Oh my gosh, this is so flattering up close. Oh my god. I love this. Oh my gosh, I love these. I love everything. It's so Halloween-y and so fun. Um, anyways guys, <laughs> this is put this video has put a big smile on my face. It sort of got me into the Halloween spirit. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. As usual, I'll put the links to all of these items below so you can check them out. Or if you just want to have a browse on Rose Gal, I'll put a link to their website in the caption below as well. In conclusion, I absolutely love all of these items. They're very Halloween-y. This one is so cute. I just love the trim of this one. It's just so nice. I think I suit like sort of a square neckline. Like I think that's why I love it so much. It also matches my hair. That's probably why I love it. Anyways, as usual, a link to all my social medias are in the caption below as well. Please go and check out Rose Gal for your costumes and fits for this Halloween. Honestly, I'm so impressed. This is amazing for us plus size girlies. These are going to fit you amazingly. This is my first experience with Rose Gal and honestly, I am so impressed and I'll probably be returning for next Halloween or maybe to stock up on some more Halloween outfits. Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!